Good morning, Mustang families. Today is January 5th, and I'm Asteria hosting from home. Try this act of kindness. Choose to be happy. That's right. Happiness is a choice we make each and every day, and when truly achieved, is never based on circumstance. Here's Miss Brizzy with the responsible winners. Hello, Mustangs, and Happy New Year. We are going to find out all the winners from the last week of the Be Responsible Challenge. So way to turn in your work right before break. Congratulations to you all. So we're going to have two winners that get Starbucks and four that get the mystery swag bag. So here we go. Hey, awesome job. You just won Starbucks. Okay, next up. Chase Williams. Nice job, Chase. You also just won Starbucks. And now we're going to move on to our four winners for our mystery swag bag. Jacob Wayman, nice job. All right, the next mystery swag bag will be. <laughs> Lena Velichica. Sorry, I probably messed up your name. <laughs> next winner for the swag bag. Sophia Brown, great job. And Alex Carpenter. Way to end the year by turning in all of your work. We have one more grand prize drawing from all the names that went into every wheel during this Be Responsible competition. So stay tuned. Have a great rest of your day. Now a message from student government. Hey Mustangs, this is a student government update. The results of the food drive are in. In third place, we have eighth grade with 1,725 points. Second place, we have 7th grade with 3,300 points. And in first place, there's 6th grade with 5,325 points. This is more points than 7th and 8th grade combined. 12 families, which is 74 people, were helped this year. 6th grade, you will be receiving your winner Wednesday tomorrow. Stay on the lookout for the sign-up form that your teachers will be giving you. The BSU has had two meetings so far, but it's not too late to join. Check out the BSU Google Classroom for more info. This again is the code for the BSU Google Classroom. Thomas, thanks. Have a good 2021.
belated birthday to Mr. Banks, Mr. Gaither, and Mrs. Pierce. Let's meet Mr. Posner. Mr. Posner is a new PE teacher to Will Rogers this year. Um, okay, so it's been really nice being at Will Rogers. The staff has been incredibly supportive. Anytime any teacher is confused or stuck with something that's been going on with the new Zoom life and new teaching, um, every, it feels like every teacher jumps in on email and is willing to help. And so that's been great. I've really loved being a part of the Will Rogers staff. I see arm with a arm with a part, shoulder with a part from our bunny Joseph. Awesome work. Caden and Oz are showing us that 90 degree angle dropping down. All of our demonstrators are right in front. Can I get three demonstrators to turn to the side and show us that flat back for a push-up? Uh, as a teacher, I feel great, like feel supported, really like it here. Love my students. Um, I've really liked Will Rogers. Uh, and I, I mean, I've already been shouted out in the Mustang Morning News by Mr. Wurcher. So I, I feel like this is a great place. I feel happy. I taught at, in Marysville at McKinney Intermediate last year. And the year before I did my student teaching at West Campus High School in Sacramento. So this is uh. like my third year. But yeah, distance learning's worked. Um, I was nervous at the beginning, especially with PE. Everyone asked me like, how does PE work in Zoom? And it's hard to answer. It's still not easy to answer. We're not doing normal PE, but what we do in PE is absolutely working. We've got kids um, in multiple different forms, working on themselves, on their, their physical fitness, doing journals, doing um, different concepts so that they can build to certain goals that we'll have when we come back. Down 12, down 13, down 14, and down 15. It's time for this week's shout outs. This shout out is for Miss Esquivel because she always helps us in class when we need help. And she cares about if we understand the assignment. She always uh, wants to help us if we're stuck. So thank you, Ms. Escobar. Hello, this is Mrs. Day, and I'm here to give a shout out to Zion in my first period English class. Zion is new to my English class, and he has been working really hard on getting his assignments turned in and asking questions when he needs a little bit of help. I really appreciate your effort, Zion, especially with being a new student to my class. Awesome job, Zion. Go to the Will Rogers website to be and submit your own shout-outs for students and staff. You can see your shout-out on the Mustang Morning News. That's it today for the Mustang Morning News. I'm Mysteria signing off.